Hello and welcome to Not a Drama, Just Tech, No Drama. So as per the title, I'm going straight on to the point of the video, how to get better audio, especially for the Valve Index VR headset that I own. And I would presume as well that will apply to the uh, HP Reverb uh, G2 because they have a very similar uh, audio setting. So especially with VR, with the overhead earphones, uh, you may be happy with the audio quality, but not enough with the kind of like loudness and the levels of maybe different applications you're using at the same time. As per the title, I'm going to talk specifically about uh, eye racing, uh, but you know, this is generically applicable to any game you play through your VR assets. So I'm going to show you how this is done, very simple. And then if you want to stick around because you're interested uh, in uh, eye racing in particular, uh, then I'm going to do a few remarks uh, on that as well. So very simple, absolutely easy to do. What you need to do is, first of all, obviously ensure that your um, Steam VR is uh, on and the headset is connected uh, and you will just simply go into sound settings so you search from the soundbar sound setting you open sound setting and you want to go to sound control panel um, once you open a sound control panel it, here you have it uh, you're going to have the list of all your devices obviously this will depend now first important point is uh, i believe this is an option for nvidia gpu cards only right so uh your mileage may vary if you do not have an nvidia card let me know in the comments below if you have an amd card and you have the same options what you need to do is to uh, identify your index headset right in the playback device uh, and as you can see the audio is going through the nvidia uh, audio uh, drivers what the, the, is the good thing here if you double click here you're going to go into advanced uh, sorry, in enhancement, and you're going to be able to enable low frequency protection and loudness equalization. Low frequency protection will, um, as I say here, keep the frequencies of certain uh, level to avoid distortion, right? That means that you can crank up the volume then of your headset 100% and have no distortion. And very important, loudness equalization. This will fill in the audio of your headset and really give you all the power you need uh, without distortion. And the good things of loudness equalization is that it will bring up a notch uh, any other type of audio that you may play on top of your game. For example, if you're chatting with your uh, Discord uh, friend while you're gaming, right, you're going to be able to hear them clearly on top of the sound of the game because any audio is brought to the same level of loudness. It works very well. I'm very satisfied with my uh, audio once uh, I did that. Now let's move on and uh, I'm going to show you uh, just few things you need to be aware uh, when doing this uh, with uh, iRacing. So we change now the settings while uh, iRacing is not running. So that's perfectly fine. Uh, if you change these settings, right? So if you enable and then you apply these settings while the game is running, you're going to uh, lose sound in game. And I'm going to show you a very simple way to just get that back. Another option you may see is special sound. Now you can enable it and see how it sounds for you. Uh, but I found this quite counterproductive, uh, especially for VR, uh, because the ads that already have special sound, um, this is adding just a little bit too much reverb, so I didn't really like it. But again, enhancements, right? Low frequency protection and lowness equalization, and your audio will be much, much better. Let's hop over in a racing. I'm just going to show you what to do in case you lose audio when changing these settings. So let's move into iRacing and let's see the difference with uh, the settings off and on. So at the moment, I have uh, iRacing uh, loaded up and I have actually now disabled the low frequency protection and the uh, loudness equalization. So let's uh, have a uh, listen to how it sounds at the moment. Right? So this is the sound that you have at the moment without the filters. So let me pause this.
right so what we are going to do now we are going to change uh the uh, settings right so i'm going to enable low frequency i'm going to enable lowness equalization and i'm going to apply this and clicking okay right so i apply this let's hear how it sound no sound at all right so that's normal because when you change those settings you need to ensure to re-trigger the audio configuration in erasing so let's see which kind of audio configuration you will need in erasing first of all yeah you don't want to use direct sound system default you want to use x audio system default so if i now switch over to x audio and i click done and let's hear the difference So now the sound is much, much louder, right? How you can appreciate yourself, right? And it's really feel you in, in the adults, right? So in case you already had uh, exit audio uh, selected and you don't have audio when you change the setting, you can just quickly go into direct sound, go back into option sound and switch it back to X audio and then your audio will be back even after you actually apply uh, the filters uh, as we explained. So this is really it, right? And you're going to notice as well, while using other applications on top of iRacing, such as Discord, CrewChief, everything will be crystal clear. If you use the spotter um, in within iRacing as well, you will hear it much better on top of the engine sound. So all the loudness levels will be equalized all the low frequencies that create distortion will be uh, removed. You can really crank up the volume up of uh, your index to 100% of your reverb G2 and enjoy super immersive audio. And just as a, a pro tip, little thing as well to be aware um, in erasing uh, sound wise uh, is to ensure and this, this can be a preference settings, but I really like it like that to crank up as much as you can the ambient sound and then lower down the in-car sound that will make the cars around you sounds uh, much louder with all these settings in you will have a much more immersive experience uh, especially in a racing that's my uh, mainly uh, playtime at the moment uh, on my PC so I didn't really extensively test it with other games uh, but you know it's a genetic tip but on top of that, uh, especially for erasing, those little tips uh, may help you out. So hope you like this video. And so if you did so, please thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. That's always help. I'm on the road eventually to a thousand subscriber. Once maybe it will happen and we become a rich YouTuber. So see you on the next one. Have fun and uh, enjoy. No, 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 no.